Hello, everybody. Welcome to Wild Man's Corner. Standing here with Scott Schroeder, the head golf coach at UNF. And, and Coach, you know, kind of a, not necessarily a treat, but you guys got an important player back in the lineup this year, Sean Dale. Yeah, Sean, uh, obviously, redshirted last year, took care of some stuff. And uh, having him back gives us a guy that can win golf tournaments. And you want as many guys in your lineup that can win golf tournaments. It gives you the best chance the team for the team to win. What's that like? I mean, I know he had to sit out last year, but what's it like when you get a player back in the lineup of that caliber? He's, you know, top player in college golf. I mean, he did a great freshman year. How does that boost the Osprey lineup? Well, it helps a lot, you know, because you're not improving your five spot. You're taking your five man, getting rid of him, and you're putting in another one man. So, um, I mean, I, what he does is he brings competitiveness to our lineup too. He expects to win, so it pushes everybody else. So for us, he's a it's more as much emotionally and pushing the guys to to, to want to win as it is just him playing. Now the Ospreys have had a pretty good fall. You guys are up there in the rankings this year. What, what's been the key to success so far for you? Consistency. I mean, I think all five guys have played pretty consistent and I think last tournament we didn't have a, a score over 74 um, you know so far here we've got not similar similar thing almost everybody's in, in the in the hunt each day which you know takes the pressure off everybody when they know if they do falter everybody else is going to have their back. Coach you know a lot of people when they think of Florida think Florida think Florida State I know we had we spent a couple years ago talking about it at the John Haight UNF where do you think UNF is on that on that Florida golf map? Uh, you know, I don't know. I think he got a lot of good schools in the state of Florida. And, you know, our goal is just to try to be the best we can be. And, you know, at, at the end of the day, if we're in the final eight and Florida and Florida State are all in the final eight, then that's great for UNF and that's great for f golf in Florida. So, um, you know, obviously our goal is to be the best in the state. But more importantly, our goal is to try to be the best in the country. So that's, that's our goal and we're going to keep working towards it. How good is this team you have this year? Uh, well, hopefully we're going to find out a little bit more tomorrow. Um, you know, I, we think we can be pretty good. They're pretty consistent. Um, I think we're going to be should be able to play pretty solid all year long. You know, two years ago we missed making uh, match play about four or five shots, and mm -hmm. I think this team's as good as that, if not a little better. So we'll see how they can do. Last year, a bit of a down year. You guys are trying to get back to nationals this year. What do you guys need to do or concentrate on to make sure you get back? Uh, it's Riviera this year. Yeah, I mean, our goal is we just want guys to show up, work hard, and have a good attitude. If they do that, I think we have enough talent that we'll find out how good we are when it, when it matters. And, you know, right now we're at Isleworth when we do this interview, but you also host a very good tournament of your own. It's called the John Haight Intercollegiate. It's up at uh, Ponte Vedra. Talk about that. What, what do you think is the most important thing about hosting a good college golf tournament? Good golf course. At the end of the day, all the, all the best programs in the country want to play good golf courses. And if you have a great golf course, they're going to come. Now... As we wind down the fall here, what do you think has been the most surprising thing for you as the coach at UNF this fall? Um, wow, well, that's a good question. Um, I think my freshmen are a little more talented than I thought, um, which is good. You know, we got I got another freshman at home that's even just as talented as the one that's here. So that's good problem to have. Yeah, it's going to hopefully keep them working hard. And that's, at the end of the day, is what I want is I want five, six, maybe seven guys working hard, and you know the team will be good because of that. All right, well, Coach Schroeder, the Ospreys, best of luck in the spring. 